He sees me. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna go this way. I'm sorry, my little Big Mac. I have to do this to you. I have to take away your bushes because if I played any bit of War Thunder with this amount of bush on it, I guarantee you I would have half the damn comments getting on my butt about it. So for video purposes, let's do this. Well, I guess that looks a little bit better, right? Oh, come on. This is like the same thing as shaving your beard for TV. It, it sucks. <laughs> as a guy who has a beard, trust me, I would not do this for that. But you might be wondering, how come I'm complaining about bushes and how come I had them on, right? Two specific reasons. The first one being that this machine gun port is one of the biggest weak spots on this vehicle. Anything shoots you right here, you're dead. Simple as that. Your whole crew dies. Your crew is pretty tightly compact right there. You're pretty much dead. You get shot in the side, you're dead. You get shot in the sprocket area, uh, slightly angled, you're dead for the most part, right? But if you're a Panther, if you're a Tiger II, etc., all you gotta do is, for the most part, aim center mass. If they're slightly angled, you might have a hard time with the Panthers, but if they're dead on to you for whatever reason and you decide to miss a machine gun port, aim for the center right here, aim for the flat turret face, break the mobility right here, because their gun, this thing's gun, is just... Let's just say it's a bit of a struggle if you don't know what you're doing. But before I go ahead and dive further into this vehicle, I just want to let you guys know really quick that if, for whatever reason, you're going to be making a purchase in the War Thunder store, use my 3% discount. doesn't matter if you buy Golden Eagles, Vehicle Packs, uh, Premium Time. If you use my 3%, you save 3%. It goes to me, and you get my in-game decal. I mean, what's not to love, right? It's an easy way to support the channel because I know you guys do buy a lot of things in the War Thunder store. Just use my damn code. Trust me, it'll save you some. It'll benefit me. What's not to love? Also, keep rocking that decal, guys. It's awesome to see it. Seriously, I get super humble whenever I see it. It's it's awesome. <laughs> Anyways, back onto the Jumbo itself. A little bit of history about the Jumbo. This vehicle, at one given point, was sitting at battle rating 4.7. It started off at 5.3, I believe. It moved down to 4.7 at some point. Then... Gaijin realized that this thing is way too OP and it made the Germans truly suffer, which it did at 4.7. If you got into a full down tier at 3.7, you were bullying the living hell out of the Germans, right? But that's not really true anymore for the down tiers because this thing got moved up at one point to 5.0. And then Gaijin still realized that, man, nobody knows how to kill this damn thing. I have no idea why they don't know how to kill this. I guess new players, etc. And then they moved it up to 5.3, a whole PR lower than the 6.3 successor that is the 76 millimeter version of this. This is the Shrinkin' Dang 75. And I say it like that because this gun, if you don't know what you're doing with it, you are going to struggle. I promise you you're going to struggle. So in today's video, I'm going to try to show you guys kind of how to use it against everything except sort of the Tiger 2s. You kind of got to outplay them a little bit because, man, their turret face and their front end is, is pretty damn hard unless you shot trap them, hit them very specifically, and it's just... You'll see in the video itself if we get into it. But a little bit further into this vehicle itself, uh, the armor plating is really brilliant, right? 38 millimeter front plate. You have a 76 or 63 millimeter front uh, back plate, which does add on quite a bit at a good angle. But again, Panther 1s will kill you from the front if they know what they are doing. And you'd be surprised how many Panther players are exceedingly good at what they do. Going on to firepower about this vehicle, you'll see that I am going to be using the M61 shot. It is the APCBC. I will be carrying some T45. In truth, you, I probably won't be using this too much unless I face certain things. But this is going to be my go-to. But man, look at that, right? 104 at flat. The flat pen does matter a lot of this BR, but the 82 at 30, 39 at 60 base pen, yikes. <laughs> God, just don't shoot anyone if they're angled at you for the most part, or at least try to outplay them, which is what I will be doing, at least trying to, in today's video. So without further ado, let's take out this American Big Mac and see how well it truly performs, at least in my hands. Let's begin. Okay, uh, 6.0, not exactly a terrible, terrible BR, and we have the Russians too, which means that we got all the heavy hitters on our side, and I get to face the Germans. Oh, yes, <laughs> this will be a lot of fun. Really? We gotta play that thing at some point. Anyways, uh, I just want to point some things out really quick. One is that uh, this thing is pretty damn quick for its size, right? Maybe not as fast as that, but that's kind of a given. And also, 
angle your armor. Angle it, angle it. Not, uh, if you angle like this, you're going to die. If you angle like this, you're probably not going to die. But you probably will anyways. It really depends on the skill of the enemy you're facing and how well you are of a shot. Just saying. So anyways, uh, 34 rounds of ABCBC. 17, wait, is it ABCBC? It is, okay, cool. Uh, 17 of the uh, APCR because why the hell not? And also, I did cheat just a little bit. I'm sorry, I did put an A screw on this thing to make my life just a little bit easier for making this video. Cool, awesome. I don't want to spend all day making this damn thing. <laughs> Anyways, let's make this good. Go, little BM13, kick their asses. Ooh. Oh, uh, oh, this will be interesting. Go ahead and do that really quick. I need to get to the, uh, I need to say kind of angle to this guy. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Oh, we're good, Tiger. Let's hope he doesn't know what he's doing. Break his gun, gotta go for his gun. Nope, bad shot. Come on. Don't aim for the machine gun port. There we go. And flat on. No flat on. All right, all right, gotta knock out his gun. Nope, bad shot. All right, going for this. There we go, perfect. No panther front. For his gun. Bad shot on my part again. I know I gotta go for the shoulder. Uh, nope, didn't work either. Okay, his gun is down. Over the shoulder again. Gun pen again. Sorry guys, going for the cupola again. Uh, it's doing him, we're doing him in very slowly. Oh, side on, side on. Perfect. Oh, that was a perfect shot too, wasn't it? <laughs> What's shooting me? <laughs> oh, hi. Perfect. Yeah, he could have kicked my ass. Easily, just saying. Tiger again. Not pen. Woo. Let's try that. Break his track. All right, I want to keep him there. I don't want him to... Let me try something. I want to keep him there for a little bit. Uh, this guy right here. Perfect. Second. Tiger front. Perfect. Let's just bully this guy really quick. I gotta get really up close to him. Perfect. Well, this is going a lot better than I expected, to be honest. Tiger front. Ooh, got a crit. Gunner, loader, commander. Going for his gun next. Nope, bad shot on the gun. Got to angle appropriately. Ugh. Keep potatoing my shots. That's all right. Undamaged, I got a better reload than you, buddy. You're missing a few crew. There we go. Perfect. When in doubt, go over the capola. <laughs> Wait, did you find him? No, he's, he's dead. Oh, 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 let me guess. Right in the machine gun port. There's there's no other way. Uh, no, right. That was actually a good shot. I haven't seen that. Very nice. It's all right. We'll bring out something different. There's a lot of things flying right now, and I decided to bring out this thing. This is the most absurd 5.3 jet you will probably ever play. In fact, this is the only 5.3 jet, I think. Pretty sure it is. It turns incredibly well. Really good firepower, but it has one notable weakness. It doesn't accelerate well at all. If you get this thing in a climb, it's going to stall very quickly. But let me, uh, let me show you what this thing can do in a dogfight against props. Wait for this guy to pull up really quick. Oh, no. Opportunity. Oh, big opportunity. There we go. There we go. Ooh, wait, what? I messed up? That's okay. I can just do this. Oop. I didn't mean to break that, but that's totally okay. Look at the turn radius of this thing. It's nuts. <laughs> oh, man. I'm in complete control of this fight. There we go. Ooh. Ooh. Nice try, buddy. It's all right. Come on. I'm sorry. I'm a little pooper at this. Ugh. That could have been better. I know you guys were cringing at that. It's totally okay. Ooh. Woo. Too close to their uh, to their base. 
That's all right. Come here. Ooh. Ah, I'm way too close to the base. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Ah! <laughs> uh, this thing's absurd, isn't it? Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh, yeah, I'm bound. There we go. Gonna crit on him. Oh no, I'm bound. Yeah. See what I mean about acceleration on this thing? Ah! <laughs> I don't even care. This is a premium. Woo! There it is. Ugh. That was fun. So I'm going to say it flat out. This sucks. It really does. This map is not meant for this type of BR. I'm sorry. This is what I like to call a top tier map, which means that you're going to be sniping each other with thermals and darts at kilometer distances and so on and so forth but for this come on but when i play top tier i get maps like sweden or uh, uh well, i was gonna say white rock fortress but that's kind of a dead map now but like all these small maps for top tier and all these gigantic maps for, for low tier but come on really guys you, you're killing me here anyways i'm gonna play this thing like a medium tank because i am fully up tiered and there's a lot of things here that can kick my ass in a single hit from distance so let's get moving well, Chinese M18 front. Oh, boy. Sorry, guys. I'm a, a little bit terrified right here because there are... I saw a lot of Tiger 2s. Uh, Tiger 1s don't necessarily bother me too much, but um, Tiger 2s, yeah, they scare me a little bit. Anyways, that's one down. I hear another one front. This will be interesting, to say the least. Ooh, M41. Just kill the teammate. I want to see if I can... Uh, there he is. Oh, 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 oh hey. Uh, hey. Hey, hi. Oh, boy. Hi. Right. Break your gun really quick. Let's see if I can 50 cal you. All right. I want to kind of keep him there for a little bit. Oh, boy. You, I could definitely kill. Assuming I get the right shot on. All right. This is, uh, this is not going so well. I'm going to say the least. <laughs> so... Yeah, let's just stay angled, yeah? Try again, buddy. No, you're not. I'm curious. I'm curious. I am curious. All right. I'm loading up the APCR. It's the only thing I can really do right now. I'm kind of hoping he's got ammunition on that shoulder. Does he? He does. All right, cool. Go a little bit more right here. Perfect. Dude, he was carrying so much ammunition. Holy shit. <laughs> they got that Panzer for very nice let's move up this is uh kind of turning into a quick game yeah uh and i hear that by the way it sounds like some sort of tiger at uh it's a panther no it is not a tiger it is most certainly a panther all right um yeah let's get into a brawling fight with a panther shall we oh he's popping smoke he knows i'm coming clever clever girl okay let's see Aha. Uh -huh. Side on. Gotcha. Ooh. I don't know why he didn't just put out the fire to begin with. Maybe he tried to load up a shell beforehand. And we're getting very close to them. Um, let's not be here, yeah? I got something in front of me. I got multiple things right in front of me. Side on. There we go. Perfect. Bad shot on my part. I got one right there, too. Go ahead and get this guy first. Perfect. And it's a panther. Come on, stay there. Oh, uh, we can do reverse. <laughs> yeah, right. Wait, 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 wait. What? What? I'm not that far away. Holy shit. Um. Ooh. Okay, okay, they got him. Really? I'm terribly surprised. Um. Yeah, I guess distance means everything. <laughs> I miss my darts. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, that's the game. And I'll be honest, it uh was pretty good. But yeah, it was a lot of fun. I'm, I'm going to show my side because why the hell not? Let me get this last kill. No. <laughs> oh, all right. It's maps like these where I truly miss my bush. Yeah. See, you guys made me do this. The mean comments, the mean people. I mean, <laughs> in truth, I don't really care. <laughs> I just have it on there just so that you guys don't complain about it too much. So I'll live with it. It's fine. It's fun. Uh, by the way, we are fully up tiered, so same strat. Play this like a medium tank. Try not to get too close to him. Actually, we have to. <laughs> With this gun, we absolutely have to. 
Oh. I got one coming this way. It sounds chunky. Oh, it sounds really chunky. I got a guy up front right here, too. But I think he knows I'm coming. This guy, on the other hand, he sounds really chunky. So let's see what it is. Oh, it's a tiger. Hi, little tiger. Right, little tiger. <laughs> let's see if we can fight him. Here we go. Nope. Stay right there. I cannot hit his capola. It's like so huge. Come on. I can't hit it. I just, I cannot for the life of me hit it. Come on. And right here. Perfect. There we go. I guess I got his gunner. I think he realized that too. Let me go ahead and break his gun. Yeah, I know. Toxic. I get it. Ooh. I got him directly side onto me, I think. Yes, perfect. I think he's got a friend behind him. Yeah, give me a second. I broke a lot of his crew. He's got a long repair time, I'd imagine. And judging by the fact he wasn't firing so fast, he doesn't have an ace crew on it. Hey, buddy. Perfect. Awesome. Let's get out of here. <laughs> nice. Very nice. I don't know if he got both of them or something. No, he didn't get them. Instead, what he's done, he's marked them for me. So I should be able to do this to him. This guy, on the other hand, I need to get him right here. Perfect. And I'm going to see if I can get to the side of him. Go and break his gun. And, yeah, boop. Perfect. I know, kind of a scummy tactic breaking guns, but when you're this thing, it's kind of necessary. Nope, non pen. I got him dead to rights. Yeah, sorry, buddy. Right, track it really quick. Or... Ah, that was a weird hit, wasn't it? <laughs> what are you going to do, reverse? Ah, he's got better reverse rate than me, that's for sure. Hey, buddy. Dude, what is it with Tiger players and carrying so much freaking ammunition? Seriously, 20, 25 rounds at the very most. Just saying. Whoa. Oh, that made me jump dude ah oh, i was so focused on listening to that guy to my left that i just ah oh. great that was funny i gotta bleep that out now <laughs> so here's something that's very curious i have gotten an up tier every single game 6-0 to ooh, yeah we're not gonna do anything to him <laughs> i'll take his track but we're not gonna do anything to him let's uh let's not go this way yeah but yeah, I've gotten a 6-0, 6-3 game every single time in this video. So it's kind of unusual because at times I do get down tiers when I'm not recording or streaming. It's weird how that works, right? <laughs> and also, one more thing. What's the difference between the Cobra King and this uh, this Jumbo? Is there any difference? I mean, I'm pretty sure it's just a, uh, historical significance, but I don't really see anything else other than that. Feel free to let me know what you guys think. And yes, I know Google is a hell of a drug, but in truth, I want to hear it from you guys instead. Oh, boy. This is going to be interesting. Uh, it's not going to work, isn't it? No, it most certainly is not. So I'm bringing out the APCR. Or he can just leave. That that works, too. Back to APCBC. Oh, is that a panther? Oh, boy. Um. Oh, yeah, he's coming side on to me. Come on. Perfect. Sorry, I had to get that perfect shot. That was nice. I still got that tiger. I got two tigers right down there. I'm definitely not going to play with those. Uh, you might want to not do that, buddy. There you go. <laughs> let's uh, let's not go this way. Yeah, I think he gets it too. And the front. Go for the track. All right, cool, cool, cool. I don't want to inappropriately angle myself here. I'm trying to figure out how to kill this guy. I don't think I'll be able to, but he did pop smoke, which is a good thing for us, which means I can move up. Perfect. Let's do it. Oh. Who's this guy? Sorry, buddy. I didn't know you were there. I will take it. Oy. Hey, buddy. Um. I'm gonna break your gun. Actually, screw him. I'm gonna break your track. Go ahead and do that really quick. Come on, don't aim for that. No, uh, he did. Come on. Come on. That's what I wanted. 
Nope, you're not gonna have this, buddy. Right now, oh, great, great. That's not good. Thank you. Oh, terrible shot right now, aren't I? It's all right. Get this guy really quick. Lovely. Another one front. Oh. All right. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's the average German player, I swear. I'm, no offense. It's, it's just all in good fun, guys. I promise. He shot. He shot. He shot. Let's get him. Right here. Just what I wanted. Roll of thumb. You see a tiger? You knock out his gun. I can't 50 cal him, but that's okay. I'm going to go ahead and track him. Or not. I can just have that happen, too. I got another one in my heart left. Uh... There he is. No shot. It looks like a uh, that muzzle break. I can't identify it. I think it's the Panthers. Oh, judge about how fast he's moving. Yeah, it's Panthers. All right, perfect. Give me that muzzle, buddy. I know. I know you guys are hating me for this. I get it. I hate myself sometimes for it. Nothing. Well, that's interesting. Come on. Really? All right, fine. Screw it. I'll just do this. <laughs> I'll just get to the side of you and knock you out. I see him. Perfect. And I rocked my tank, didn't it? Come on, come on, come on, fire. Perfect. Another one. Yeah, let's not stay here. And they're coming down from their spawn. But I want to show you guys something really quick. Look at this. Look how many times they've tried to shoot my machine gun for it. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's pretty insane, isn't it? That's why I say, bush up that machine gun port, guys. Most players know how to use it, but yeah, it can be uh, it can be a daunting experience without the bush. Just saying. Tiger front. I'm gonna load up ABCR shortly. Go for shoulder again. Let's see if this works. Oh, great, I'm on fire, aren't I? Oh, um, hi. I didn't see you were right here. Don't mind me, please. That's all right. It's all right. It's all right. Gotta knock out your uh, teeth, buddy. I'm sorry. And boop. Uh, my engine's cooked, but it's okay. I'm gonna go ahead and do this. Do that. Yeah, you're bone. <laughs> I'm sorry, buddy. You're bone. And he knew it too. I'm sorry. Well, I've been hunting for the last of the uh, stragglers, and I just cannot seem to find them. So I'm going to assume that this is the end of, uh, well, the gameplay segment for the video. Because all that's left is some people. But uh, they're mostly just flying around right now. And this game's going to be over by the time we get into some action. So let's get the hell out of here, and let's uh, let's talk about the final bit, shall we? Oh, wait. Hold up. I was about to hit that stop recording button, but there's one right there. Oh. Is this where I get nukes? I don't know. I was, <laughs> I was literally leaning over to go hit the button to stop recording. And uh, I guess there's one guy right here. <laughs> Come on, give me something. Let me get him. Yes. I'll take the last kill because... Oh, by the way, we almost had a nuke. Not that we have one. <laughs> oh, shit. All right, I get it. I'm out of here. I'm leaving. Jeez. So after all things considered, I think I did pretty good. I don't know. There's a lot of shots that I didn't place appropriately. Okay, I'm sorry, guys. I don't play this BR as much as I used to, all right? If you guys know my content by well, any stretch, I play mostly top tier. I love my darts. I love my thermals. I love my super high mobility, composite, relic, ERA, Abrams, go bird, you know, area. <laughs> it's a lot of fun up there. But this, this reminds me of just how much fun you can truly have in War Thunder because at top tier, things are, are pretty linear for the most part, right? Armor doesn't really matter too much. Uh, mobility is absolute key. Mobility and just pinpoint accuracy uh, when it comes to your darts, which is very, very easy to attain. Laser range finders, thermal sights, they make life a hell of a lot easier up there. Down here, you got to know what you're doing. You got to know where to put your shots. You got to know how to angle. You got to know how to do just pretty much everything. Understand what you're fighting, your limitations, their limitations, etc. And you don't really find that too much at top tier, or you do in its own way, but it's much more linear up there. And I love it. Don't get me wrong. I'm not, I'm not bashing my top tier experience because I still play there 95% of the time. But down here, though, 
It reminds me of how fun War Thunder truly can be when you understand exactly what to do in the environment. But then again, I did make some pretty potato shots. I made some very questionable things. I did very questionable things. Come on, I'm, I'm barrel killing your barrel. I'm breaching you. I'm, I'm tracking you. I mean, you kind of have to when it comes to this type of vehicle because you just don't have the sheer firepower to deal with everything pretty much frontally. Say Tiger 2s, etc. Come on, it makes sense. You're going to have to fight them in a very dirty way. Okay, and I know I can already hear the comments or uh, read the comments and how they're already flaming me for, oh, God, you're blah, blah, disgusting, barrel breaking, blah, 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 you know, play like a man, get good kind of thing. It just, come on, guys. It's worth Thunder. You go for the dubs, right? <laughs> <laughs> just saying i promise i won't say that it's such a cringy word anyways but when it comes to the jumbo itself even a 5.3 it still plays incredibly well and yes i'm putting my bush back on this thing because i'm not gonna do that without my bushes again where are you come here you're, you're here somewhere camouflage oh these are pretty these are brand new huh oh did they change these i didn't even see that are these uh, no they're the same oh okay uh, uh yeah but there we go yeah <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll tune it up later anyways uh i hope you guys did enjoy everything let me get, uh, know what you guys think about just the entire experience as a whole i'm getting more into down to your stuff here in the content or on the youtube side of content english hard you know what i mean caveman go burr and uh let me know in the comment section and while you're down there feel free to take a look at again that three percent discount code because why the hell not if you ever plan on getting say the cobra king there you go, you know, 3% Golden Eagles. It's it's pretty nice, right? Cool. I'm totally trying to sell you guys. <laughs> I'm sorry. All right. Anyways, again, guys, thank you so much for checking this out. It was a blast. I hope you guys enjoyed everything. If you want to see this gameplay live, mostly at top tier, but somewhat down here too, uh, feel free to follow me over on Twitch. Link is down in the description below as always. And uh, come say hi. I mean, you'll see me live with a beard and everything. It's not the love, right? But... Again, I'm sorry. Last time I'm saying this, thank you guys so much for everything. And I will see you not only in the next video or even the streams, but in War Thunder itself. Until next time.